Macroni Macroni Macaroni Macaroni Alright y'all, we are finally getting E-Man a new car seat and stroller because clearly he has outgrown this one. Alright y'all, we having a hard time trying to choose which car seat to go with i'm saying we should go with the my hair wrist and harness adjust one easy step this one is rear facing five to 40 pounds then what does this say forward facing 22 to 50 pounds and then belt positioning booster 40 to 80 pounds i feel like this one would be a better investment for longer. Um, and Shelton is thinking we should go with this one because one, it reclines like that. <laughs> um, it has the extended leg room position and he feels like he may be more comfortable in this, but I don't know. I'm just to the point where I feel like I don't wanna be out here buying another car seat, so. And then E-Man with his feet dangling out of this car seat stroller over here. We just need to figure it out. He needs to, he like, y'all come on because it's 11 o'clock at night. So, I don't know. But, I mean, he's past this stage where his head needs to be like this close. This is, this was newborn. I mean, unless we trying to have another baby sometime soon. Yeah, it's not newborn. Today is Ethan's first day of daycare. So, um, it's a, it's not like, it's a different type of program, not really considered daycare, I would say. Um, it's a program that they have at <clears throat> a lot of different churches here in Dallas. And basically what they do is um, they keep the kids twice a week for a certain period of time like some programs are from like eight to three and then some programs are from nine to two and stuff like that so um it's pretty much a program to help stay-at-home parents um you know get some things done and get like some me time i guess you can say and it's a lot cheaper than actual daycare if y'all don't know this because i didn't know this but this is Ethan's first day of daycare, uh, or first time going to daycare. Daycare is expensive, y'all. Do y'all hear him in the back? Big boy, what you talking about? You good back here? Um, Daycare is expensive. It is $640 a month for daycare. Ethan is 10 months old, like, No, that is that is too expensive and then they say like as they get older it gets cheaper and so I get I understand like it it is a little bit more expensive since you know he's a baby but I don't know maybe I'm tripping but it just makes me appreciate that's child care here in Dallas so that just makes me appreciate on post child care because on post child care was like um I want to say it was like 400 or somewhere in that price range for his age. Uh, it's like 480, I think. Um, for his, what is the? Is it? Oh, I am in the school zone and I need to slow down. 
Um, I'm sorry, y'all. But yeah, it's like 480, I believe, for daycare on post. So that's a lot cheaper on the military installation. It definitely makes me appreciate being on the military installation. So, um, anyways, I tried to get a nice picture of him for his first day of daycare, and I'll show you guys the picture that I got of him is funny. <laughs> But anyways, you guys, I have, Shelton and I have prayed over him. We are praying that um, he has a blessed day, that he will um, would want to eat because y'all know he's been around me all this time, that he has been on this whole thing where I'm not taking a bottle of milk. I don't want a sippy cup of milk. I want to be breastfed. And so, with that being said, I, um, I'm just praying that he will take a bottle. But he does, he has, um, potatoes, um, some baked macaroni and cheese and, um, corn for lunch. So, I know he'll eat that. And he has a cup of water. So, I know he'll eat that, but it's the milk that I pray he eats. And there is a Starbucks over there. Um, but yeah, and your girl really just didn't get dressed this morning. As y'all can see, my hair is, uh, and my hair is everywhere. <laughs> Wet hair. But, y'all yeah, know what I'm trying to say. Anyways, if I can get some footage inside, I will, but I doubt that I will be able to because there's still some paperwork that I need to complete. So, you guys have a blessed day after I drop E-Man off. I am going to try to run some quick errands. I have to be at class today at 2 o'clock, so he will only be spending a half a day there. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to try to capitalize on my time. And I'll tell you guys how they say he did. And if this video is really blurry, my apologies. I'm, like, vlogging from my phone, and I didn't wipe off the, um, the camera portion. So, my bad. I haven't vlogged from my phone. I mean, my camera in, like, forever. Um, anyways, that's neither here nor there. Talk to you guys later.